So this is Lucas User. He joined us before on Cycling Illustrated, and he's here to break some news. He's currently riding with Spider Tech through 2013. So where are you riding in 2013 for that whole new year? Where are you going to be? Well, I'm happy to announce that I'll be riding with the United Healthcare Professional Cycling Team. Wow, that's huge. It is huge. I'm excited. Um, so you're going to be the man there now that Rory is gone. Um, how did this whole thing go down? Take us through it a little bit. I know that Timmy Duggan got signed and then the Spider Tech team decided not to renew their commitments. Where did that leave everybody feeling? Was t Just tell me about how the emotions went of that. Well, Brandon, I, I have to be honest, and, and you know, I, I started looking for a new team this uh, early, early in the fall, um, late, late summer after the after Tour Utah and, and the USA Pro Cycling Challenge. Uh, I wanted to put my feelers out there and, and see what was available for me. Um, United Healthcare came to me actively. They 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 sought me out and they wanted uh, they, they saw my consistent results and they, and they felt like with their resources they could turn those into into consistent podium finishes. So it was really nothing against Spider Tech, but I, I I felt that my the, it was the right move to go to United Healthcare um, before all Spider Tech Spider Tech went down. Um, I, I I I I obviously wish these guys the best in finding new teams. I think they have. Um, I had time at Spider Tech. The sponsor was incredible. Uh, I'm still going to be involved with using their product, but uh, for the most part, I, I was happy to to go off the venture. That's great. United Healthcare is a great program. They got a lot of fantastic bike riders. Now, is that team is that team staying at the same level? Are they splitting the team? Um, do you know any of their future plans? Yeah, for sure. They're you know they're staying at the same level, if not growing. We um, if you look at what their their season they had last year at the Pro Continental level, they they really made. Uh, they really made point and, and made a presence in the in the peloton. They you know they won races in Europe. They won races uh, some of the big, biggest races in, in the U.S. And you know they they definitely um, proved their worth. So in that you get rewarded and you get better invites and you get better um, better sponsors and, and you know bigger budget. And, and in that I think the team is growing and I think uh, you know they're very modest and, and they don't make promises but they they they're that team that just keeps working you know they've been for about eight years and uh i'm happy to join the organization and, and be a part of that structure well that's that's great news um i'm really excited for that um <laughs> i did not know where you were going to land but um that's like music to my ears i think you'll be a great fit um in their beautiful kits that they have and they the, have the, the money the and the resources to support you and uh get you some victories and in the coming year, so we really appreciate that. Uh, do you want any? You want to add anything else, Lucas? You know, I want to make, I want to emphasize that I'm not replacing Rory. Uh, Rory to me is he's a great friend. He's been a mentor. He's been someone who has helped me along my career. Um, you know, I wish him the best on his new endeavors. But by no means uh, am I just notching in and, and filling those big shoes that that he he uh, you know he implemented. Uh, I think that what the team has taken a bit of a new approach. They have this uh, this amazing speed team that uh, has showcased its, its its talent in the USA Crit Series as well as uh, sprint victories and you know races like the Tour of Utah. Uh, you know, they I, I'm going to integrate into that team as part of a, a, a three pronged GC approach with myself, Mark Demar, and Philip Dignan. Uh If you look at the three of us, we each can bring something different to the to the table when it comes to the GC, and uh, I think we're going to have a really dynamic team next year in the sense that uh, anybody's going to be able to take advantage of a situation if the if the opportunity presents presents itself, and and we race aggressively like the team has shown in the past. Well, I agree. Um, they are always a powerhouse, and um, you know we just I, I hope you can make some of the crits out here in Southern California. I'd love to love to come. You know, have you come down and, and yeah. watch you? In some I, I, of those. I may make some guest appearances and some crits this year. However, they're not my uh, they're not my strong point. And uh, well, we, we we know you're <laughs> you're a climber, and uh, and we look forward to watching you on the tour tracker and on TV when it plays. So we yeah. wish you the best of luck, and we always thank you for checking in with Cycling Illustrated, and um, we'll follow up with you uh, during this year if that's okay. I sure hope so.